You okay, man? Yeah, I'm just... I wish I hadn't pulled that trigger. Just try to forget about it. No, don't... Right here, Clem. Don't forget about it. Alright, sorry, homeboys. But I'm sitting here. Here you go, Clem. It'll be fine, Luke. So, Clem, we were just talking. What's the deal with the kid? And what's his name? Luke? He in charge? You trust him? I trust him. Kenny, please. Sarita, we don't know these folks. They seem nice. Yeah, well, gators seem nice, too, till they bite your damn arm off. Kenny. I like him. He's a good guy. Would you trust him with your life? Yeah, I would. I think so. Luke, specifically. Specifically. That guy, Big Al, he said they were on the run. Some people are after them. Well, you don't have to worry about that no more. They'll go tomorrow and you can stay here. Absolutely. Honey, you stay with us as long as you want. She's staying for good. If that's what she wants. Of course she does. Right, Clem? Oh, what about... Oh, fuck. What about Krista? Gotta find Krista. I need to find Krista. I feel like finding Krista is just really necessary for me to feel good about anything. But I, now I found Kenny. I don't know. But Luke's a decent person. I don't know. Hey there. Hey. Hope you like the food. Oh, it's it's great. Thank you. Peaches and beans. Great for nutrition. Not too great on the way out, though, I tell you. <laughs> <laughs> so it's Luke and Nick. Luke and Nick. You guys sure do look like a match. What's that supposed to mean? I'm just saying you look like good friends, that's all. So, what was your plan here? Hold out for the winter? Actually, we were thinking of moving on. Somewhere up north. You ever heard of a place called Wellington? Wellington? The hell is that? A place. What kind of place? A good one, Einstein. Yeah. Krista and I were going there. Supposed to be a big camp up near Michigan. Michigan? You got a hearing problem, kid? Yeah, Michigan. Think about it. Fresh water, lots of land, and cold-ass winter so the walkers get slow. Sounds like bullshit. Listen, Vanilla Ice, I don't know what your deal is, but you're more than welcome to take off in the morning. That'd be just fine by me. What's the deal with these guys, Clem? Hey, fuck you, buddy. It's fine, Nick. Shut the fuck staying. up. She's staying. What? Excuse me? You heard me. Please, don't fight. God, Nick, shut the fuck up, Nick. Gentlemen, please. There's no need for this. Yes. Now look, we've all had a long day. Please eat. I'm disappointed in you too, Luke. I thought you were cooler than this shit. Stupid ass small talk bicker. Ask me that can, duck. Whoa. <gasps> Whoa. Duck? Oh, Who's Kenny. Duck. Leave him alone, Luke. Hey, Clementine, would you uh, lend me a hand outside for a moment? Of course I will. I'm out of here. Fucking man, children. Uh, I'm sorry about that. You know, I used to be a teacher, and I remember what it's like to be caught in the middle of two clicks. I suspect they'll find common ground soon enough. It may take a little time, but that's just how these things work. Everything will be fine. Man, you're a cool guy. Maybe too cool. Listen, relationships are like any machine. You don't throw them out when they break down. You get your hands dirty and you grease the wheels. What do you say? Will you help me work on them? The two of us must unify our factions for the common good. You know, like Churchill and Roosevelt. None of these options are good enough for me to answer. They say the world is over, but I'll tell you a secret. It's not. People are more political now than they ever were before. In the end, we can't change the world. All we can do is continue to learn from each other, to empathize and use our heads. All war is a symptom of man's failure as a thinking animal. Steinbeck, have you read him? Yes, I have. Well, we have plenty of time to catch you up on your reading. 
My partner Matthew is amassing quite the literature collection. I think you'll like him. In any case, the point is, as long as we have our wits about us, we can always make the right choice. Right? Right. This guy seems really cool. So cool that he seems suspicious. It's never that easy. It's not ever that easy. I think he's right, but it's never that easy. What's the matter, Clementine? Is there something you want to tell me? You can talk to me, Clem. There's almost nothing you could tell me that would surprise me. I can promise you that. I'm worried about your friend. I think that... Don't worry. Matthew will be back soon. And everything will be fine. But I think... Hey, kids. What are you two talking about? I think Matthew's Carver. Oh, politics. The hell? Well, being from Florida, I would imagine you know all about politics, Kenny. Man, I know one advantage of living in the apocalypse is not dealing with that shit no more. My man. I was just gonna check the windows round back before this storm hits. Give us a hand? Sure. Miss? Come here, lady. Please, do you have any food? Are you okay? I saw the house and I have a family. We're starving. We live down there. Uh, uh, of course. Why don't you come in, Miss... Bonnie. Walt, I don't know. You just gonna let her in like that? It's fine, Kenny. We don't know this girl. Then we'll have to get to know her. Right, Clem? You're letting your Walt, guard down just because she's a woman with a family, huh? How much damage poor woman do? Check her for weapons. That's right, girl. Yeah. <laughs> really, but that storm will be on us soon, and I gotta get back to my family. Nope, check her for weapons. You. you don't have to do that. No, no, it's fine. Kenny put the gun at her. We've got plenty. You stay put. I'll be right back. Oh, God. Just because she's a woman and she's got a family. I love how Clem said that immediately, though. Check her for weapons. I have a little girl like you. <laughs> how old are you, sweetie? None of your fucking business. None of your business. I'm sorry. I didn't mean nothing by it, hon. Yo, Kenny, point the gun at her. I'll check her for weapons. Oh, Jesus, God. Here you are, miss. This is too much. Don't mention it. I don't know how to thank you. Just help someone else down the line. Thank you so much. I'll be going now. You stay safe. You too. You're... You're too nice for this world, man. You're too nice for this world. How are you still alive? Clem, go on inside and get to bed. Walt and I gotta talk for a second. Walter. You're gonna get a scolding. Walter, what are you- what are you- a What? What was you trying to get out of that? Don't freak out. The fuck you want, Luke? Don't you make me Listen, pick, man. If you man, make me pick- you something. I'm bouncing. That guy on the bridge was Walter's friend. Oh no! That's why they're so nice. Oh no! See, I knew something was off, so I asked Sarita about their friend. Now they're all worried he's not back yet. Where's Nick? I don't know. I don't think Walter knows yet, so we have to keep this oh, quiet. Oh god. Who knows what the hell he'd do if he found out? He'd cry. Oh, no. No, this is the wrong thing to do. We should tell him. He's gonna ask who did it, and you're gonna tell him. It's the right thing to do. It's right to get Nick killed because that's what's gonna happen. No, it's not. Now, you shut up. You, uh, you still have that knife? Because if it was Matthews and Walter sees it, he's gonna put two and two together. It's with the other weapons. M and W. Okay. Matthew, well, Walter. Go get rid of it. And I'll find Walter and run interference. Oh, and, uh, keep an eye out for Nick. I'm right here. What's up? Oh, uh, there's nothing, man. I just wanted to check and see if you're okay. You coming to tuck me in? <laughs> yeah. Can't protect yeah, him forever. Something like that. We have to tell you something. Hey, if there's something going on, I want to know. No, just go back to bed, Nick. I'm serious. You guys can talk to me. He's a grown ass man. You can't baby him what, forever. You don't trust me now? Look at what you did. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. God damn it. Hey, Nick, shut the fuck up. 
I can't, man. I can't. Do not fucking blow it. Blow it? It's over. I have to tell him, Luke. What? No, you can hey, Nick, you cannot do that. Are you fucking nuts? I gotta. I can't live with that on me. Okay, I hear you, but f I mean, fuck, man. Do you know what he's gonna do? I don't you know, know him that well. Anything. Are you kidding me? Yeah, I don't think Nick, he'll do. You shot his friend. I don't think he'll do anything. I gotta do this. Maybe he'll Jesus. be sad. I can't handle this. Look, Clem, just go do that thing. Man, All shut right. up, man. Stop telling me what to do, man. Fuck, I am not gonna just do something just because you told me to, Luke. Who do you think you are, my dad? He already knows. That... It's gone. Yeah, it's gone. He already knows. But I, I'm really banking on him being too nice to kill someone. I'm really banking on that right now. However... Matthew did say that they met a lot of, um, he, they met a lot of assholes. How do they deal with assholes? They probably have to kill them, right? Walter, put the knife down. They're probably, yeah. I always like this knife. Fuck. He's got a bad side to him. Oh my lord. I'm scared. Gave it to Matthew when all this started. I know he's dead. Okay. Who did it? Was it that, that kid? What's his name? Uh, Nick? Heard him talking earlier, something about shooting a man. It was an accident. I could see it. I could see it on his face. Wasn't sure then. But now... I'm gonna bank on this. It was us. It was our Because we're not assholes. It was just an accident. Jesus, I um, I don't feel good. Yeah, if you're gonna kill one of us, Nick shot him. You can do it knowing that we told you the truth, man. How does that make you feel? How does that make you feel, Walter? If you're gonna kill us, is, uh, is Nick a good man? You're gonna have or a heavy he just conscience. Like everyone else? Is he just one of those uh, those fuckers that don't give a shit about anyone but themselves? He is. He's a good guy, Walter. He's just a little skittish and a little fucked up. He was always going out alone. I told him something like this would happen, but he wouldn't listen. No, Matt always knew best. What's going on? You fucking, you tell you fucking apologize no, right now. What happened on the bridge? You apologize, Nick. You apologize right now. Tell me what you did. Just tell me, son. Tell me what happened. From a distance, it looked like anyone. I, 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 thought, I thought he was going to shoot my friends, and I, I shot Matthew. But it, 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 it happened real fast. I didn't, I didn't know if I hit him, but I did, and I didn't mean to. Do you know what you've done to me? Do you have any idea? I didn't mean to. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Walter. They were lovers, weren't they? M and W on that knife. Oh, don't do it, Walter. Don't. Okay. Thought he was gonna. Thought he might just kill himself. Okay. That would have been a disaster too. Good on. Good on everybody. Walt, what's going on? We're leaving at dawn, it seems, probably. The storm's got it spinning out of control. That sound's gonna draw walkers. We gotta shut it down now. Nick, help me. Carry the guns. Guns? What is happening? Is Carlos bailing now? That thing's a damn dinner bell. Oh, we're gonna we're gonna go take care of it. Okay. It's farther than it. No, it's not that far. What? What the hell was what that? Was that? Damn it! Transformer must have gone. Oh, uh, we're getting attacked by Bonnie's it. group. I could aren't use a we? Hand. I'll go with you. I'm going to. No, it's too dangerous. Rest of you, get this thing shut down. All right, you can trust Luke with Kenny. That'll be fine. 
blood. I'm really worried about Bonnie's group attacking us. Does anyone know how to do this? Great. I can do it. Just give me a light. Okay. We'll watch your back. Nick, scan the trees with me. Alrighty. Instructions, gotta pay attention because dark. Cause shit. Alright. Push the switch. No good. Alright, let's see here. I'll take the key then. Shut it down, put the key in this uh, don't tell me it's this easy. Okay. That was a little too easy. Okay, whatever. Take the key with us though. I think we should take the key with us. Uh, it's probably not safe to leave it out here knowing that Bonnie and people and other people can get Something up here. Right. Pretty easy. Yeah. We don't have much ammunition. Don't fire yet. The lodge. They're behind us. Oh man. Okay. God damn it. Oh shit. Oh, is that was that a floating rifle? <laughs> Who's whose character model was that supposed to be? Carlos's? I st stood and fired. I think I should have just moved. Uh oh. Two shots to lay down. Who's the oh no, three shots for this lady. Who's the next one? Next one is you? Oh, we're 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 got we're dead. We're done. <laughs> Dunzo. Gotta move on, Clem. Okay, who was that? Thanks, Carlos. You homie. Oh no! There's a rifle down there. That's pretty valuable. If it was clear, I would have gone for the rifle myself. Oh, it's not too late. We can go for the rifle ourselves. Had a girl, Clem. Oh, had a girl, Clem. Okay. Grab it. Pop it up. Prop it up. And. Oh, why did. Oh shit, it's too strong for us. The kickback is insane. Alright. Oh, okay, grab the knife. I wanna, I wanna keep this knife. I wanna give it to Walter. That's the last, uh. Last memory, never mind. We didn't take the knife with us. Fuck. Shit. Grab. Gra gra oh. Oh, it'll be okay. It'll be okay. It'll be okay. You're a good man, Walter. You're a good man. You're a lot better than a lot of these people. <laughs> Clem, get inside! Go! Where is Sarah? Are you okay? Get upstairs. Where the fuck? What? The hell? What? Oh, God. Yeah. It's Bonnie's group, isn't it? <laughs> Fucking Carver, I knew it. Bonnie's group is with Car Bonnie's with Carver. Howdy, folks. Fuck. Where's Rebecca? Carver. Oh, I fucking knew it. Ah. Oh. Nice Carlos, to see you too. Oh! Dad! Sarah! What happened between them? Jesus. Inside. What did these people? It's you. Keep moving. You're too good for this world, Walter. 
You let your asshole meter down, dude. Oh, fucking Walter. You turned it off. You ignored it. Look at this place. She did look pretty sad, though. So maybe Bonnie's not all that bad? She looked kind of guilty. A little bit. Alright. Please this fucking place, Bonnie? Power and everything. A lot of windows, though. Alright. Fucking right. huge. Bill's gonna hate it. Now the rest of them could be anywhere. I wish she pulled the knife out. Man, how the fuck are we gonna cover these guys and look for them, too? Oh, I went Johnny, the wrong way. Cover that window. I didn't mean to go that way. I wanted to go the way of the arrow, but I went left. How the fuck are we gonna do anything up here? I mean, we can separate them and then kill one after the other. Silently, like a ninja, but I need a knife. I can shank. shot at this guy's head. Why do you want Rebecca so bad? You really think it's your kid, huh? But what do you care? Listen, I'm only gonna ask you once. Where's Rebecca? Sarah. Look at me. It's gonna be okay. Oh. Oh, Rebecca, our baby deserves to be raised in a place of safety. I know you're out there. Oh. And Alvin, Luke, and the girl. This is real simple. You want this over quick. You all play nice. And show your faces. Please. Here's a big question. Kill him. No, Alvin. Why does Carlos want to protect them so badly? Beck. The baby. You need a doctor. No. Where's Luke and Kenny? How the hell am I supposed to know? They're still outside. They can help us. He won't kill a doctor. He'll do anything. Oh! Clint can sneak out. Find Luke. What the hell is she gonna do? And you heard him? Carver knows she's with us. Just stop! Don't hurt my dad, please! Oh, God. We're going down there. He'll kill you. Fuck you! Shoot him! Somebody just shoot him! Clem, go get help. He'll kill him, Beck. He'll do it anyway. You don't know that. Say goodbye, Carlos. Don't look, Susie. Don't look. Dad. No, he needs the doctor to deliver that sweet, sweet baby. That's why. He Nobody. won't kill Carlos. Not that disappointing. I'll find Luke and Kenny. Stay here. God damn it. Oh, Hurry! You need a doctor to s deliver that sweet, sweet baby Let's of yours, your Carver. No. Ah. No. See? You won't do it. It's not gonna do it. Nobody in that room knows how to deliver a baby. It'll be fine. Just get the shit beat out of him, that's it. Everything's gonna be okay. Everything's gonna be okay. Okay, Sarah, you take a look at your daddy and know that nothing can protect you but yourself. That's what you should learn from this lesson. There they are. Clam! Oh, I got lucky. I was actually gonna go downstairs first, but I just kept on going this way. What's up, asshole? I wanna, sh I wanna shake you so bad. Where's Luke? Can't feel. You're right. Where's Luke? Where's Luke? Hell, I don't know. It was 
whining about something or other, so I told him to take a hike. Huh. Take I've all got of a them. pretty clear shot on the one. Just a little bit to the left. You son of a bitch. I don't know. Maybe we should go find Luke. Kenny. Ugh. Got him. God damn it, Kenny. Always quick with the trigger fingers. Oh no, not Walter, no. Walter, you're too good for this world, Walter. No. Oh. Fuck, see what you Whoa. did, Kenny? Oh you see the consequences of your actions? You never did see the consequences. That's for our man. Now, I didn't want to do this. But you ain't leaving me much choice. So here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna march another one of your friends out here, and I'm gonna put a bullet in the back of their head. Or you can give up now. Your choice. Motherfucker. Ugh, now you're just wasting ammo. Kenny, over there. Hi, Elvin. Bill, no! Tell him to stop! Kenny, stop! <gasps> Alvin! What do you think? Clam! I got a shot! Ah, fuck it! Shoot him! Yeah! Oh, I didn't actually think it was gonna work. Oh, trusting Kenny's good. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Oh, Alvin! Rebecca! Don't look! Just don't look, Rebecca! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, did I do that? Was that my fault? Oh fuck. I feel like he would have shot Alvin anyway. I can keep this up all night. Sarita! Well, you're not gonna ask for Clementine's opinion this time, huh? I should have grabbed that gun, yo. We're coming out! But I feel like if I shot. Oh, if Clem grabbed the gun and Kenny pulled the trigger. Let's go. He would have shot Alvin anyway, right? Where's Luke? Oh god, fuck. Finally cut and run, huh? Uh, Why am I not surprised? Uh, I warned you. I warned you not to follow him. Look where he's led you. But you're safe now. We're going home. So Luke is the leader? Family. I thought Carlos was like the leader. Round him up. We're heading back to camp. Why did they run from him? Why did they run? They had a camp. Uh, you know, besides the fact that he's kind of a fucking asshole. Oh, Clementine. I see, baby. I'm sorry. Everything's gonna be okay. Everything's gonna be okay. Oh, shit. Son of a bitch would have shot Walt no matter what we did. Well, I ain't going out like that. Not without a fight. Yeah, I know. The folks are sore over what happened. But let's remember, these are our brothers and sisters, and they all have a vital role to play in this community. They strayed from the flock, yeah. That don't mean they can't earn their way back into the fold. That don't mean we can't find it in our hearts to forgive them. Knowing full well, those who choose not to accept our love will surely wish that they had. A storm is on the way. Is 
So the dude legit is just kind of nutty with a power trip then, huh? Alright. Uh, you and most players blame someone else took blame for Sarah's photo. What? Okay, whatever. What did you s Oh, I blamed her dad. That's right. What did you say with dinner? Kenny, of course. Because I really don't know the others as well as him. Told the truth. Nick's fate? Left to find Kenny. Well, good second episode. Oh, well, actually, I was going to say somewhere in the middle that this episode was feeling kind of lacking, but, you know, towards the end there, there's a lot of stuff that happened. When we hit the, uh, the ski lodge, it was starting to feel like everything was getting, like, kind of lax. The pacing was kind of dropped. Wasn't at the edge of my seat. But now I am. One weird thing though is like I don't know whether it's just me being more reckless with these decisions or me rationalizing like being able to rationalize them faster than season one but the decisions don't really feel all that gripping. I'm surprised Alvin died but part of me thinks that it might have happened either way. I don't know it's just or maybe I've played these decision type games for too long I'm not sure. His body was never found In the pines, in the pines Where the sun never shines We shiver the whole night through You've caused me to weep You've caused me Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed Season 2, Episode 2 of The Walking Dead. I thought it was not bad. Um, it's always kind of difficult to say whether these singular episodes are good or not since there's only ever like an hour and a half of gameplay. It's never enough time to really sink your teeth into it, you know? But thank goodness all fives are out, so I'll see you guys real soon in the next episode. Take it easy. Bye.